Hi guys, and welcome to another video with me, Shira Star Hobby. Uh, as you can see, I've got Kiwi back for another dress up video. It's very exciting for me because in this dress up video, I will be changing her eyes. Then I will be trying on this outfit that I just got um, from um, some random eBay shop um, from China. And I made her this wig, which is like a short bobbed wig using the hair that came with her actual wig um the wig that came with her full set because i like the color the, like the color is perfect on her and finding this this white blonde hair in alpaca is very hard at least it is for me um which i still want to make her an alpaca wig um with pink underneath like you know pink hiding underneath in the you know but anyway, for right now, this wig is actually really super cute. It looks really good on. Um, it looks really short, but it, but on, it, it's perfect. So um, I want to, you know, I got some silicone earplugs from Walmart. You know, they're like a dollar and some change. Um, and you've got plenty here for several dolls. And I've got um, several dolls incoming over the next few months and I know that I'm going to be you know changing out eyes and trying out eyes so I needed to get some more because I was completely out so let's attempt I haven't done changing eyes I haven't done changing eyes in a very long time um, because most of the dolls that I have came with eyes that I was already happy with so I didn't really have to worry about changing them but this is an Etsy shop called Alruna's Aesthetics, and she's on Instagram as well, which I just started following her um, when she had a giveaway not too long ago. And she has so many gorgeous eyes. Um, and she even has a fruit series, like you can see on the sticker here. These are watermelon. And she's got um, cantaloupe and maybe not cantaloupe, but she's got like orange and lime and honeydew. And I forget what color I chose. Um, I want to say it was the honeydew because she didn't have, I don't think she had any kiwi. Um, that would have been kind of perfect, but, um, but yeah, she's got a variety of fruits and then she's got like the fantasy ones with stars and then she's got ones with hearts and then she's got some with flowers and they're resin which is really really cool um i know a lot of like anime eyes are um you know like kind of plasticky but it, these look really really nice and like i said before in my other update video if you if you saw it i wasn't sure if these were gonna fit i asked the artist um isa of, of isla dolls what um these are cute. I don't know if I'm supposed to, if I can change these out and put those in there. Um, I probably won't even try that, but these are really cute stickers. Um, so I, I asked the artist Issa what size she recommended best for Kiwi and the rest of the fruits girls. And she said 20 to 22 millimeters. And so I think these, the fruit ones come in one standard size, which is 20 to 22 millimeters. And so they look really big, but I am excited to try these on her. So let's get to it. If you guys uh, were able to get in on the last pre-order of Kiwi, I am, I am very excited for you. I love this. This is such a beautiful detail in the back of the head cap. Um, yeah, so if you guys have been following her on Instagram, you'll, you know, you'll know that she posted that this will be the very last time that you can order Kiwi in this full set um, with, you know, the, 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 green, the green sweater and the pink skirt combo. Um, so, and then, of course, this is a handmade face-up. I just added the earrings with white acrylic paint myself. Um, so, this is very exciting. So, you can see here, she's just got the that white putty. Um, I don't love this stuff, so getting this out might be 
Well, I guess it's not as difficult as I thought it was going to be. Um, it's just, it, it's just very not, I just don't like how it gets all gooey like that. So yeah, these are kind of like a plasticky eye, um, which are the ones that she comes with. Um, I did order blueberry, which I'm super pumped about because her full set is like purples and blues and you know, purple's the best color in the rainbow. And I love her little grumpy face. So she's going to, and I love her skin tone because she's, you know, she's kind of pale, like an Asian girl. And so she's definitely like a true, you know, little Japanese anime girl for sure. Um, so I'm excited about getting her. I got her full set as well. Um, and so uh, I'm not sure when she's going to be coming, but she's coming sometime soon. So yay for Blueberry. Um, so let's try these. I don't know. Are they just kind of stuck on here? Okay. So, ooh. I am loving that. Oh my gosh. They are perfect. Like, really perfect. <gasps> I'm super excited now. Because I was really afraid that they were going to be way too big. So, this is awesome. And they're handmade resin eyes. Ooh, and she even puts little A's in the back. And I don't know if you can see the, the sparkly A with the heart in the middle. Oh, that's really cute. I like little things like that that the artists do to like kind of customize and make and make their own. So, like um, you've probably seen Allison do a million times on her show on her channel you, you I take one and split it in half because that's enough for one pair of eyes and I do one of these where I kind of make like a long noodle with it long enough to go around the entire eye and then kind of pull on it to stretch it out a little bit and then I kind of just do one of these. Oh, these are so pretty. And she's and she's got a lot of variety of eyes too, so all right, let's see if I can do this on camera, because this is gonna get <laughs> this might get a little bit difficult. I really, I am so pleased. Oh my goodness. And I haven't left a review yet on her Etsy shop because I haven't put them in Kiwi yet. And of course I like to, I like to share a photo when I leave my reviews on Etsy. So, oh, that looks really good. Oh my goodness. I am so excited. I'm so glad I got these. Okay, let's do the next one. Sorry for the, I keep hitting the camera with my hands. This is kind of like a, I don't know what you would call it, but like a crafting exploration video, I guess. <laughs> I don't really know. I am working on, um, at least I have the box kind of set up and ready to go. I have to layer the walls a little bit more to strengthen the walls and I've got to pick a flooring I don't I kind of want to do a carpet I don't want to do the hardwood I'm kind of tired of doing hardwood floors in my dioramas um, and so for the for the fruits girls um, I'd like to um, I think I want to get like a really pretty pink carpet type uh, flooring for their room and um, this diorama is huge and I <laughs> was trying to stay away from making these mega huge rooms because they take up so much space in my doll room um, but it just so happened that the box I chose and the style of the room is kind of perfect and it'll fit you know two or more um, Isla dolls in there so Aren't these gorgeous? 
Oh my gosh, I am so loving them. Oh my goodness, they are really perfect. Oh Kiwi, you look sensational. You look fruit-tastic, fruit-tastic, okay. So now we can put her back on her body so that we can get her dressed in this mega cute outfit. And so what I did, which I like to do a lot on eBay, is I search uh, quarter scale MSD BJD. And I just see what, and I just kind of see and what pops up. And there's, you know, there's like so much on there. And of course you have to be careful of, um, recasts and that type of thing on eBay but of course I'm not searching for dolls I'm just searching for clothing and shoes so this shop popped up and I like the style of the clothes that they have in there and I also search for MDD which is the mini Dolphy dream uh, because they can share clothes even though Kiwi isn't as tall as the mini Dolphy dream um, they can still wear similar size clothes. And this outfit that I have here is meant for the mini Dolphy dream. So even if it's slightly large on her, um, I can either take it in myself and just kind of hem it so that it fits, or I can just, you know, leave it and have her looking all kind of baggy and oversized, um, which is, which is fine too. Um, the, you know, if you've seen mine and Allison's day out with Kiwi video, you'll, you'll see that the, the shirt, the sweatshirt that comes in the full set is an over, oversized sweatshirt. So there's that. I didn't realize that the sleeves were like that, like they're just only attached right here, which is kind of cool. I might could remove this completely take them in so that they're super mega tight and make them look like arm warmers that might be really cute um of course you know this is meant for the mini dolphy dream so on the model in the picture um the outfit looks fantastic <laughs> because it's, it's on a much bigger doll so i love that it came with accessories like this belt and the skirt is super mega cute and look at that it's a real pocket and the price tag was really good i want to say this whole outfit was uh with free shipping too from um from china um i want to say it was 34.99 or maybe it was 44.99 it's one of those two and i mean it's not terrible like I kind of wish it came with shoes I did order her shoes but they are also coming from another overseas Etsy shop so lord knows when those will show up but oh my goodness I love this outfit on her already I love it already I don't know maybe if this is supposed to go under um Let's, let's see here. Um, so, yeah, I'm like trying to make videos on the weekends when I've got a little bit of time. Work is interesting. Um, there's a lot to learn. So, um, but it is nice to have a steady, you know, a steady income instead of me, um, like I, I, I miss working on dioramas like severely. I really, really do. Um, but it wasn't a steady income for me. And so, you know, needing to get things like supplies. And then of course, if I decided I wanted to get a new doll, it was always difficult for me. And I always had to choose between selling a doll I already had to bring home another one or you know, just not getting a new doll at all, period. And just wanting and, <laughs> and I mean, that was, that was difficult for me. Um, because, you know, I see all these other people that just kind of buy whatever they want when they want. And, and, um, and I'm not saying that I'm going to like start buying like buttloads and buttloads of dolls, but 
Uh, but it is nice to know that if I, you know, do want a new doll in the future, I can, I can do that. Um, and like I said, I've already got several dolls incoming, which a lot of them you guys already know. Um, I've got Blueberry and um, I've got my uh, Tamakin Space at Nothing Sapiens, Naora 15 girl, who is going to be coming... Um, sometime next year, probably February-ish. Um, at least that's, you know, how I've calculated it. And then um, I've got a couple, let's see. I, I just ordered another Dart Dolls, D-A-Art Dolls, um, the same maker as Altine. Um but I, of course, I ordered a different face mold, and I and I ordered some of the extra, like the extra feet and the extra hands and stuff. So she'll be kind of, you know, she'll be completely different. But but yeah, I've got some, you know, a nice, a few nice incoming dolls that I'm excited about. Um, and so this outfit is really cute. I'm really pleased with the socks because usually. If you're buying a MDD outfit, uh, the socks are usually like way too big and way too long. So that turned out really, really good. So let's see what you guys think of her, her new wig, which I have to glue it on because I like to make sure it doesn't move around on me. But, but here she is with her short, cute little bob. Oh my goodness. I love it. I love these eyes, you guys. If you guys don't, um, you know, if you guys want new eyes for your kiwis, or you, or if you've ordered raspberry or blueberry, and you and you're thinking you want to try some new eyes out, I highly recommend these. These are fantastic. So, I will leave you guys with this and some um, pictures at the end, of course, because I can't not take her picture now that she's looking super mega cute. Not that she wasn't before, but alrighty. And then, of course, they're nice enough to include some free gifts, which are these cute little flower clips. So I'm probably going to put those in her hair, too, and she'll look like a real little anime girl. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So I appreciate you guys watching, and I hope that everyone's doing well. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!